Tell me more about this digital twin. Do you mean a digital twin of the building? It's a digital twin of the building. Say you have an office building and it has all of these assets that you need to manage. And so this technology, you know, with the help of a human, can do a digital twin of that. And so now what you can do, instead of you sending a technician out immediately to the space to troubleshoot or do something dangerous, frankly, there's oftentimes that happens, you can actually visualize this from a laptop, you know, from wherever you are. It's pretty interesting because you can actually follow your asset. You can visualize what's happening with that asset and you can make determinations before you physically go out and either troubleshoot that asset or call in a vendor to, you know, troubleshoot it. I mean, oftentimes what happens in facilities is you might not have the skill set on site. So then you call one of your vendor partners, they come out and, you know, either they discover it or they don't and it takes more time or it's not really the point problem that you were calling about. It's something else. I just think Digital Twin has some amazing capabilities. And I know we're getting there, but the companies that have used it, you know, seem to have leveraged it very well.